What's going on YouTube? This is your boy Ty Ray Man. I'm out here dashing for the first time in the new market. Just on a little mini vacation, but I'm always working, always making money. So right now, I am on my I'm in the Baltimore, Maryland market. And I'm on my third order right now. So, throughout the course of this video, I'm gonna be putting my total earnings throughout the day. So, this is, this is a busy market. I noticed this is a very busy market for DoorDash, so can't complain. So, right now I'm up seven minutes towards my destination on this third drop off. I already picked up at the Chipotle restaurant. 800 feet. Turn left. Yeah, turn left. GPS. Without the GPS, I don't know how I can get around this area, but gotta have a GPS to get around. So, DoorDash, man. It's amazing, man. You go anywhere around the city, wherever it's DoorDash, turn left. Dash. You guys gotta do is just call DoorDash like hey I want to do this market do this market and within like a couple of minutes you can get everything transferred to this market that you pres I'm presently at right now and you can start door dashing and start making money which is good so stay tuned later throughout this course of this video I'm gonna be doing more door dashes Going on. Currently, I'm heading to my fourth pickup right now at the Cheesecake Factory. My second pickup was at the Cheesecake Factory. Now, my fourth one was at the Cheesecake Factory. It's not bad. And everything is within distance, which is good. You guys probably noticing how I'm doing all of this right here. That's how I'm doing it. I don't have to worry about gas, I don't have to worry about finding parking. I eliminated a lot of expenses. So right now, currently heading to the Cheesecake Factory right over here. Turn right, then. Turn right. Heading to the Cheesecake Factory. And you're doing a pickup at the Cheesecake Factory right now. Now, Cheesecake Factory. All right. Stay tuned, guys. Yes, on my way, dropping this order off. It's my fourth pickup and heading to a drop off. The drop off is about four minutes, which is not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all, man. It's pretty consistent over turn here. Turn left, then turn right. I got to turn left and I have to turn right. Well, still staying straight on the course. It's not bad at all, guys. Turn right. So it is nice and beautiful. In 600 feet, turn right. In the city of Baltimore. Right here. A lot of traffic. You're probably wondering, how you doing all of this video plus carrying food? Turn right. It makes everything easier because I'm on a unicycle. I'm doing everything on a unicycle. Which is good. So I have like two minutes towards my other. In a quarter place. mile. At the roundabout, take the second exit. You see how the GPS is so accurate, man? So about to drop this order off and on to the next order. On my fifth delivery, right now delivery is on my backpack. This is a little longer than what I expected. I got my hopes a little too high. So this one is gonna be a 15 minute ride, but for when I have something like this, I don't have to worry because I'll be going through traffic like this. So right now I'm just going through traffic on my way to the dropping off the food. That fifth order was at the Chinese restaurant. I didn't have to wait, which was good. 
not even a minute. Everything was prepared. Everything pretty good. It's on point. Not bad. So right now, getting some fresh air as I'm doing this drop off. About to drop this off and be on my way to the sixth order, guys. So stay tuned for the next order. What's going on fellas on my way to my sixth order right now it is it's clicking right now man it's it's busy you just got to go to the hot zones the hot zone area is like downtown where i'm at in baltimore so you just got to go to the hot zone areas and you guys will be good to get orders so on my way to my six pickup right now it's about five minutes from here about five minutes so not bad so, going through this traffic right now, heading out. A little rough roads over here right now. Rough, rough. But I can go through these bumps. No issues. I can definitely go through these bumps. So, this right here, slow down, and I can go through these bumps as well. So, uh, these are like ancient 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 bricks right here so they see this section over here it's ancient and there's still trains over here it reminds me how in the, in the new york area around in the 1920s that the trains go on the regular streets but out here in baltimore trains are still over here it still runs on the street which is cool man so i gotta stay around um this route and go from over there so on my way to the six, the six pickup right now. So on the way to the six pickup, cause Wayne, this light, this light is taking too long. So on my way to the six, six pickup, and stay tuned. Six pickup. Here we go. What's going on, people? It is so hot out here in Baltimore. It feels like it's 95 degrees right now under the shade. And right now, just bumpy roads, bumpy, bumpy. I'm on the regular roads right now with cars. This is my sixth order right here. I got to pick it up. I did pick it up, what I'm saying. I picked it up on my way to the drop off. Got about five, five minutes of travel. About five to six minutes of travel, I'd be good. So, five to six minutes of travel. Now we get to go. So I'm speeding. Got a wind blowing behind me because I'm going over 20 miles per hour right now. The faster you are, the faster you make money. The slower you are, you won't make as much money. Keep that in mind, guys. So, on my way to dropping this off, and then from there, I'm going for the seventh order. Alright? So, Stay tuned, gotta go, gotta make things happen, make this money, out here in Baltimore, peace. Um, still at it, still at it, and still doing delivery, so I got a Wendy's order. This is my seventh pickup, and I'm dropping it off about five minutes away towards my destination. I've been traveling about 10 minutes, so this was a 50 minutes in distance. I'm the, in the inner cities of Baltimore, so uh, not bad. Just on his way, dropping this off. I just had me uh, a strawberry lemonade to keep cool and a dark chocolate fudge uh, cookies. I love dark chocolate fudge cookies, so I um, had that. I was a little hungry. Um, right now, like I said, on my way, five minutes is at the stuck at the red light right now. I am sweating, man. It is, like I said before, like 95 degrees. It's blazing hot. Blazing hot. And after this delivery, I'm going to get me at least a one liter bottle of water. And keep me hydrated, man. Got to have water. Oh, yeah, you're going to see me keep going. Everybody is admiring about my unicycle right here. So... Yeah, you're gonna see me go. Say hi to the camera for me. What's up? Oh, this is one young fella right here. So what's up, what's up? <laughs> yeah, so on the next to the 
What's going on, people? This is your boy Tyree on my eighth order. Right now, this order you wouldn't believe. This order is four minutes away, $11 for four minutes away. You cannot beat that. I wish I was getting getting this all day, man. Because I'm, a, you know what it is? If you accept every order, so DoorDash give you those little big orders, those $10, $11 orders. So I got about three minutes. Hey, how you doing, man? Turn left. So, wow, I'm here already. Uh, I got, I'm about two minutes, if that. Yeah, about two minutes away, and uh, I'm good to go on this eighth order. And then I'm gonna be charging up and do a little bit more orders in the e later on later on in the evening time, and I'll be good to go. So I got about five more blocks to go before the destination, and I'll be good. All right, on this drop off of the eighth order, All right, guys. So. Peace Back at it again. DoorDash should not want me to leave off the platform. I'm about to log out on the ninth order. And this order is six dollars and four minutes. Why couldn't it be the eleven dollars like before? But you know, it's different. For every restaurant, it's different. Sometimes it usually depends on the distance. How far you gotta travel, the more money. But sometimes that's not the case. So, money is money. So $6 for four minutes, not bad. So, on the way to the next, next drop off. Well, turn right, make a right then here. turn left. I'm about two minutes away, so, Let's see if DoorDash offers Turn left. me more DoorDash deliveries. All right? So. In 800 feet, turn right. Oh, wow. I missed. Oh, that sucks. I missed it. Wow. I missed the exit, actually. Oh, actually? Turn right. Let me go here. So. Now me going through this little alley. In 600 feet, turn right. Turn right. And then I'm actually, actually like one minute away. So stay tuned for more DoorDash deliveries. If I get number 10, yippee. But uh, stay tuned for more DoorDash deliveries. Peace out. What's up, people? DoorDash doesn't want me to leave. I'm about to log off, man. And good news, double orders. So I'm going for the number 10 and the number 11. So I got two orders at the Cheesecake Factory for the fourth time, which is good. Business is booming out here with DoorDash, man, in, in the Baltimore area. I'm in the downtown area of Baltimore. It's at the red light now. Green light has changed. So, best transportation in the world. Right here. In 1,000 feet, turn left. 1,000 feet, I gotta turn left. Right. Woo. I got one more block to go. Make this left. Head out to the Cheesecake Factor. I hope you guys are doing great and having an awesome Monday. Hope your Monday is going good for you guys. Been at it for a couple of hours now. My shift is going to end around 6.30. So right now, 6.06. So I've been working around since 1, one something this afternoon. So right now, the temperatures is cooled down right now, which is good. It's not hot. It feels about maybe around between around 60 degrees, but it's cool. It's very cool right now. So 
I don't know if it feel like it's about to rain for some reason. I don't know, but I don't think so. But um, on this way to picking up these double orders, first double order out here in Baltimore. So I got to head on to, I got about five more minutes left before I reach to my destination and I'll be good to go. So in a quarter mile, bridge. your destination will be on the right. A quarter mile, so that's not bad. Red light drop in. I have first order and then the second order. It's on my backpack. It's getting busy right now, man. It is uh, it is booming right now, man. It's really booming. I can't complain. It is booming. The sun is back. Before it was cooler, then the sun decides to hey, you know what? It's time to burn me up, Mother Nature, right? <laughs> I'm just chilling right now, making this moolah. I'm over 70 bucks right now. Not bad, and my first time in this market. Um, uh, which is good. Not bad on the unicycle I'm doing it on. I don't have to worry about this traffic right here. I don't have to worry about traffic. I can get there my time. It's convenient. Which is good. It's time for me to cross the street. And I think I'm heading towards the... Turn left. Then your destination will be on the right. Alright, my destination is coming up right here. 550. Alright. Two minutes. Alright, guys. Your destination is on the right. I'm about to drop this order off. This double order is dropping this first one, then the second one. Peace. In a quarter mile. On my way. Turn left. To dropping the left order of my double order. Look at all this traffic, man. I don't have to go through that. I don't have to go through that. You can do it in so many different transportations. Vehicles, skateboard. Me, do it on a unicycle. It's much easier. I don't have to get stuck in this traffic like this, which is crazy. Get around. And I'm good. Can't complain. Can't complain at all. About five minutes towards my drop-off point. Downtown area of Baltimore. On this way to this drop-off. Have to make this left soon. On the left. On the left, okay. Alright, on this way to dropping off this 11th order. My shift ends in like five minutes, so if I get another order before my shift ends, that'll be good. But until that, until next time, peace. Oh man, DoorDash, DoorDash, man. Loving DoorDash, man. I got my last order before my shift was about to close at 
It's 6.30 now. <laughs> um, got another order, which is cool. That's my number 12. 12 orders. Can't complain. Cannot complain. So on this way, I got a about seven minute ride. You know me, I got a jet. Like I said, fast you all, Turn fast left. you make the money. So, about to enter. Right now I'm in the downtown area again. I'm in the downtown area right now. Uh, which is cool and I hear hear a little bit of the thunder so normally I have my rain gear it's just this time I did not have the rain gear which sucks I didn't have my rain gear on normally I have the rain my rain gear all times anytime I travel anywhere around I always have my rain gear but unfortunately that's not the case I do not have my rain gear on so Let's see, I'm gonna try to do it. Try to do this last order before the rain comes down. So, not bad at all. See this bus behind me? Hope this bus can be passed. Thank you. Back on the regular road right now. On this. Alright. <laughs> Everybody's on their little scooters, man. Four seconds, I gotta do it. About to hop on this bike lane right now. Get away from traffic. Woo. I'm cruising right now. Cruising and get him paid. See, these folks are flying by me. I'm flying too. I'm going like 16, 17 miles per hour. Just cruising right now. Right now, I'm riding the hardest transportation right now. One, one wheel is not an easy task. It's like we bought a, a solid week to master it. Everyone is different. You can go ahead. No problem. You know, so kids just crossing. Look, you see the cops? They got, they got their own segue as well. They got their own segue too. They got their. <laughs> this is the future right here. Transportation, man. It's lit. Everybody's complimenting. Where you get that from? How can I get something like this that I'm what I'm riding right now? So, on my way to this pickup, this restaurant, right now, no time to waste, I gotta make a right turn soon, look at the clouds, the clouds are getting dark guys, I do not want In to In 600 feet, rain. turn right. I got so 600 feet, I gotta make a right. What would I do without your GPS? I'd be all lost right now in the woods. I had to remember, I remember one time I was in the woods and, and the funny thing is that without this GPS, I would have been lost in the woods, man. This was about a week ago. And they gotta have the GPS, man. And I, guys, I recommend when you, you're doing deliveries, you have yourself a portable charger. This is very important. Without this, you guys are not going to make no money, too. If you're doing it on bike, whatever, unicycle, electric bike, skateboard, you got to have one of these, man. I will leave that in the description, a good portable charger to use when traveling. Good portable charger to use when traveling. It's a pocket juice. That one, the one I have is a 20,000 amp. This takes about 12 hours to fully charge, so which is not bad. So you could charge it overnight, and you'd be good to go. This goes through about, it goes about 
at least 15 full charges, which is good. Turn right. All right, I got to turn right. I'm on my way to the pickup at the restaurant. In 600 feet, turn left. All right, turn left. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do this shortcut. Instead of going around, I'm at the shortcut, which is good. Since it's a one way. Your destination is on the right. Destination is on the right. On my way to this pickup at this restaurant. Peace. Just pick up the order at the restaurant. Big order. Turn eight. left. It's about an $80 order. But the good part is I'm about four minutes towards my uh, destination. I'm at the red light. So I'm at the red light. Big order. I have a little small order in my backpack. So I got to keep everything firm. I don't really trust the paper bag because sometimes it could tear. So I got to be mindful of that. So now green is for me. Oh, I hear the thunder. Now. So, on my way. In a quarter mile. Dropping. Turn off. right. On my way, dropping this order off, and I'll be good to go. I'll be good to go. So, let's see. I'm at the red light again. Yippee! All right. The red light again. Yeah, so I'm at the red light. All right, green light, here we go. All right, big section right here in Baltimore streets. The streets is huge out here, man. So I be there. It says three minutes. I'll be there in three minutes. Not bad. Not bad at all. So, heading over. Uh, let's see. All right, all right. Green light. Let's do this. Green light, let's do this. So, um, on my way to drop off this 12 number 12 order and I'm finished for the day and I'll put screenshots as well after I finish this drop off I'll put a screenshot on how much I earned today my first like my earnings for DoorDash in Baltimore DoorDash in Baltimore can't complain turn right then All right, turn right. your destination will be on the left. All right. Hear that? Destination will be on the left. So, guys, stay tuned. For more videos from me. Peace. Here we go. What's going on, man? Took a, took a big break. Back at it again with DoorDash. Um, this will be number 13 just started I'm gonna be doing just an hour depending on how busy DoorDash is so I'm gonna do just an hour right now heading to my second pickup I have a double order which is good can't complain uh, the next order I, uh, it is uh, at Shake Shack Shake Shack Shake Shack so I'm just on the move right now. Best move right now. I get a lot of stairs while I'm riding this, man. It just never stops. Questions after questions after questions after questions after questions. So, can't stop it from there, man. So, right now, I got a, I got about five to six minutes after this light I got about five to six minutes on to the next um, pickup which is good um, I'm in the downtown area of course in Baltimore 
Um, so, about to move anytime. All right, green light, here we go. So, I'm in a green light. I'm going to uh, equivalent to the same speed. I'm going to equivalent to the same speed as cars, man, which is good. Which is not bad at all. So, going through these cars right now. Through, get it through. All right, let's do this. got a block one more block to go to my second pickup all right green all right I mean look it's green all day green all day Hang on, all right so nighttime it's still day over here in Baltimore man so about to What's going on, man? Took a took a big break. Back at it again with DoorDash. Um, this will be number thirteen. Just started. I'm gonna be doing just an hour, depending on how busy DoorDash is. So I'm gonna do just an hour. Right now, heading to my second pickup. I have a double order, which is good. Can't complain. Uh, the next order, I, uh, it is uh, at Shake Shack. Shake Shack. Shake Shack. So, I'm just on the move right now. Best move right now. I got a lot of stairs while I'm riding this, man. It just never stops. Questions after questions after questions after questions after questions. So... Can't stop it from there, man. So right now I got a, I got about five to six minutes after this light. I got about five to six minutes on to the next um, pickup, which is good. Um, I'm in the downtown area, of course, in Baltimore. Um, so about to move anytime. All right, green light. Here we go. So, I'm in a green light. I'm going to uh, equivalent to the same speed. I'm going to equivalent to the same speed as cars, man. Which is good. Which is not bad at all. So, going through these cars right now. Through, get it through. All right. Let's do this. I got a block, one more block to go to my second pickup. All right, green. All right. I mean, look, it's green all day, green all day. Hang on, All right, so. Nighttime, it's still day over here in Baltimore, man. So. About got my Shake Shack order I picked up, but unfortunately the first order I gotta drop off is, is in my backpack. So I got my first order in my backpack. Then this is the second order I gotta drop off. These are my double orders. So I got about five minutes of travel, which is good. And then I gotta make a right turn soon. GPS, GPS, let's do this GPS. Gotta make things happen with GPS, which is not bad at all. So, um, I got this. Sorry guys, excuse me. 
Hello, guys. Hello. Sorry. Excuse me. <laughs> There's a whole crew of kids, man. Just, oh, is it? Gotta, oh, you guys. Hope you guys. Saw. <laughs> it's a whole little crew of kids, man. Everybody, uh, let's see. Damn. I gotta go. Where I gotta go? This gets confusing at times, guys. Uh, let's see. Where I gotta go? Uh oh. I gotta, um, this, I gotta go straight. And then from there, I got another block or so. I gotta go on Light Street. I gotta go to Light Street, guys. So, this, when you're crossing a big intersection like this, you gotta be mindful, man. You gotta really be mindful. I gotta go straight to Warren's. Gotta go to Warren. Then I'm at my destination. So, stay tuned. Hands is kind of full right now. So, let me drop off these orders. It's on to the next orders. Hopefully, I get another double order. So, stay tuned. Just finished dropping those the last order of Shake Shack on my way to a Chipotle order. Only two minutes away, which is good. But it's in total, traveling is about four miles. This is a $9 order. So Chipotle should be coming up very soon because I passed by when I was dropping up the Shake Shack order. So I passed by. It. I'm just moving. Hands free. Maybe to do videos. I couldn't do this on no bike. Unicycle when I'm free, I can do it. I can get around. I can move my hands. See, I almost dropped my phone. I have my portable charger charging right now. So, got about, about a minute before I hit Chipotle to pick up my 14th order. Yeah, about 14. I did 12 and 13, the double order. Now I'm on my way to for number 14, pick up number 14. Pick up the order 14 as well. So, oh, there goes Chipotle. Chipotle, Chipotle, like Chipotle. Chipotle right here. About to get up Chipotle, pick up this order. Swipe this real quick. Knock this out, pick up this order. I'll be on my way to the park. Peace. Out here, just pick up the Chipotle order. On my way to the drop off. This is about 2.9 miles. It's a little farther. The bigger the order is, the further it is. Sometimes it's, that's not the case. But this, uh, it's, uh, in this situation, it's about 15 minutes, which is not bad. I don't have to exert myself. As you can see, guys, this time cruising, I'm going about 20. Give it take about 20 miles per hour right now. So now it's nighttime. It's getting dark. And over here, it gets dark at 8:30. 8:30 gets dark at night. So. This I have to have my lights on, have my lights on and my tail lights always of course on the back. So uh, you guys are doing good. You guys want to know and guys don't forget to like this video and also subscribe to this channel, okay? Alright, I haven't done door dashing videos in a while so my friend has been nagging me. Shout out to Suave. My boy Suave is like, hey, you know what? Do a video, do a video. So I'm just doing a video for you guys, all right? And you want to get on to DoorDash, you want to sign up to DoorDash, 
click my link below, you can sign up to DoorDash as well. All right, I got to turn here. See, I almost missed my exit. So, you guys can sign up to DoorDash. And I think the first 100 or 200 deliveries, you get like, I think it's between two to $500. It, the, the, it's always changing with DoorDash. So, sign up. You have nothing to lose. You can make serious money with DoorDash, man. I'm telling you. You can make serious bank with DoorDash. I do bank with DoorDash. You know, so uh, check check DoorDash out. Okay. And you guys will be on your way to start making your first your first uh, check with DoorDash. And DoorDash do pay weekly. They pay every Tuesday. So when it's set, make sure your bank account is set up. Make sure everything is set up. Because nothing is set up, you're not going to get paid. So, I just thought I'd let you guys know. So, on my way to this drop-off. Oh, it's getting night right now, and I got to go through this bike lane. So, all right. Stuck in traffic, all right. Let me get out of this traffic and be out. So, guys, I'm on my way to dropping this order off. So, stay tuned. I got more orders to come. Peace. <laughs> I gotta go. Out here, just pick up the Chipotle order. On my way to the drop off. This is about 2.9 miles. It's a little farther. The bigger the order is, the further it is. Sometimes it's, that's not the case, but this, uh, this, in this situation, it's about 15 minutes, which is not bad. I don't have to exert myself, as you can see, guys. This time I'm cruising, I'm going about 20. Give it take about 20 miles per hour right now. So now it's nighttime. It's getting dark. And over here it gets dark at 8:30. 8:30 gets dark at night. So this I have to have my lights on, have my lights on and my tail lights always of course on the back. So uh, you guys are doing good. You guys want to know and guys don't forget to like this video and also subscribe to this channel okay all right I haven't done door dashing videos in a while so my friend has been nagging me shout out to suave my boy suave is like hey you know what do a video do a video so I'm just doing video for you guys all right and you want to you want to get on to DoorDash? You want to sign up to DoorDash? Click my link below. You can sign up to DoorDash as well. All right, I gotta turn here. See, I almost missed my exit. So, you guys can sign up to DoorDash, and I think the first hundred or two hundred deliveries you get like, I think it's between two to five hundred dollars. It, the, the, it's always changing with DoorDash. So, sign up. You have nothing to lose. You can make serious money with DoorDash, man. I'm telling you. You can make serious bank with DoorDash. I do bank with DoorDash. You know, so uh, check check DoorDash out. Okay. And you guys will be on your way to start making your first your first uh, 
check with DoorDash, and DoorDash do pay weekly. They pay every Tuesday. So, when it's set, make sure your bank account is set up. Make sure everything is set up. Because nothing is set up, you're not going to get paid. So, shit, I just thought I'd let you guys know. So, on my way to this drop-off. Oh, uh, it's getting night right now, and I got to go through this bike lane. So, all right. Stuck in traffic, all right. Let me get out of this traffic and be out. Gotta be out of here. I'm gonna start some jamming, some little bit of music when I'm riding too, man. It just speeds up the day a bit. But for me, I'm kind of, you know, used, used to not listen to music. I use, I listen to music, but not while really doing a video, as I'm doing right now for you guys. So, stuck in a red light again. I'm about to make a turn, so, guys, I'm on my way to dropping this order off, so stay tuned. I got more orders to come. Peace. <laughs> I gotta go.